want to go over what our vision is and where we're going. I first want to apologize because I feel like I've been very small minded. Like I've been in a growth mindset, but I haven't been in a scaling mindset. And so I want our company to scale, not just to grow. And they actually are two separate things. You know, we've been doing this grow and scale summit where we've had some of the top speakers in the world talking about this subject. It's virtual. You can watch it from anywhere, but we've gotten some really great ideas from them. Our original plan to grow was getting different offices and just keep setting up storefront after storefront. Our plan was just to keep growing more and more offices. And every time we opened a new office, we had to do this huge build out. We had to sign a new five-year lease. We had to find the managing partner to recruit for that location. We had to find a BOA. We had to buy furniture. It was just a really long process to get that office up and running. This growth is like Blockbuster grew until Netflix came on the scene and started to take over. The growth of Netflix is the type of growth that we want. And what we're finding more and more is that agents want to do most of their work remotely out in the field and they clients would rather meet at their own home or at a closest Starbucks, whatever's closest to them, rather than coming into our offices. So for us, for our future plan is to scale, which will allow us to grow. We are seeing more and more companies move from sole brick and mortar models to a virtual model similar to EXP. We want to take parts of these different models and put them together so we can have the absolute best model for you, our agents. You know, what I love about it is that in their locations, they're able to do everything virtually with no office space, but what I don't like is that they have one broker for the state, they have limited leadership to help you grow, and they offer no administrative support or any leads or appointments. So here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna make some tweaks. That's tweaks, not twerks, people. We're gonna have three hub offices. We're gonna have Barrett Street, we're gonna have Indian River, and we're gonna have one in Newport News. When Chesapeake's lease expires, they're just gonna be moving three miles down the road to the Kempsville office on Indian River, and when Laskin expires, they're just gonna move one mile down the road to Barrett Street, and we're gonna add the one hub to Newport News. But from now on, as we grow, we're not gonna be purchasing any more brick and mortar stores. Every single process that we have has to work virtually so you can work anywhere. So for instance, if you're in the Laskin office now, you'll eventually be referred to as Pod 1. Newport News, you're Pod 2. Chesapeake, Pod 3. Kemsville, Pod 4. The same way as you're all 1, all 2, all 3, all 4. What does this mean for you? Really nothing. Nothing's going to change. You're going to have your same managers, your same admin support, your same brokers. We're going to start putting things in a central hub so that you can start to work virtually. We're going to be scaling our system so that almost everything can be done virtually. From onboarding an agent to having your one-on-one, -on -one, we're going to be creating an environment where you can work from anywhere. So for example, Let's say you are um, getting restationed in the military and you're having to move to Florida. Currently, you'd have to leave our brokerage and go find somewhere else. With this new scaling model, you could still stay with our company and you could start your own pod down there. You don't have to have an office location. You can do everything virtually. It is going to help grow your business no matter where you're located. So we believe there are four things that agents need to sell. You know, we love a good acronym. So we're gonna use the acronym SELL, S-E-L-L. -L. That's support, excellent culture, leads, and leadership. So let's talk about support. You will you get that admin support to help with your transaction coordination from listing input to contract closing. You know, they call your sign up for you and pay for the sign to be installed. You know, a lot of these virtual companies, they don't put your listing in. They don't make the MLS changes for you. You have to get your own um, sign and have somebody put it in for you and install that. You have to hire someone to be your assistant if you're not going to do it yourself. So even though we are going to be switching some of our offices to this virtual model, none of your support's going to change. You're still going to have the same admin support. You're still going to have people putting in your listing. You're going to still have them calling up your sign. They're going to take care of everything. Second is an excellent culture. Since we will free up the lease and the 
utility money. We're going to offer weekly and monthly meetings, but in fun places like Top Golf or Why Not, providing just a more fun and social environment. Leads. We're going to still be providing the exact same lead service. We have nothing is changing here. We already have done that virtually. You can accept your leads from anywhere and that's going to remain exactly the same. So you're going to continue to get leads and appointments just like you always have. No changes there. Leadership. The managing partner and managing brokers will still be there to help you answer your questions with your business planning. It'll either just be done Zoom or it will be done at a fun place like Top Golf or in a back room at a restaurant. We believe that coming up more than ever, we are going to, you're going to need leads more than you ever have before. As the economy really starts to, we're seeing it now, like interest rates are really, really low. We're going to have this massive bubble that's going to start to burst and you're going to need more leads. And so we're going to be able to take that money that we're saving on leases and start to put it back in the marketing budget. So we're going to be able to use that to provide more business to you. BOAs. So the current BOAs that we have, they're going to stay the same. They, as the as the offices start to transition to a virtual office, um, they may move to Indian River office or um, the hub here at Barrett Street, but they will still do the exact same things for you guys. So nothing's going to change there. As we start to add on new BOAs, we're going to create an environment where they can work from home. So they'll still be able to do all of your contract. We already do everything virtually. Most of you turn in your contracts and never walk into the office. They'll be able to do everything they always do for you, but they'll be able to do it virtually, which allows us to kind of expand um, the expertise. We can get more people that are able to do it maybe from home and not drive into the office every day so that we can get um, everything taken care of for you. All of our training is going to start to happen virtually. They can take all of their training online. They can meet with their managing partner, their managing broker, or their mentors about it, which gets people out in the field faster selling homes. When somebody onboards, even though we are here in Virginia, we're, because we have three offices here in Hampton Roads, there will be zero paper that they will sign. Everything will be done electronically. So there's no paper. We'll literally say, here's the computer, um, fill out your onboarding paperwork. Same as if we opened the office in Florida, they would onboard on a computer, no paper, Everything we do has to be able to be done virtually. We are so excited about the growth of our company. We are so excited about being able to scale this, to provide, to take some of that money that we were just spending in office space and give it back to you in the forms of really fun culture events, but more importantly, more marketing to bring more leads in to help grow your business so you'll have a really awesome 2020.